After every match that I win or that I lose, I am going to copy my opponent's deck and try to win a match with it. I am going to do a best of 5 me against the challenge. Can I complete it or no? Well, there's one way to know. Firstly, I will start with my favorite deck in this meta, which is this one. But before we start, I want you to know that there's two spicy offers in the shop that will give you 200 hero fragments with just 350 gems. That's not bad at all, so make sure to don't miss that. Now let's go back to our challenge and jump to the first game and we are facing a shield maiden player. There's a good news and a bad news about this match. Firstly, I'll put down the mega knight and I will move it to the right hand side. I think that's not expected and put down the miner. The good news is that we will definitely win this match and the bad news is we must play with a shield maiden deck in the next match. Let's just hope that he's using a good shield maiden deck. So in the first round, I think really well played by him, that shield maiden will never die because of the healing ranger and we will lose the first round. Now in round number 2, I will put down the mini P.E.K.K.A and move my units like the miner should be in the next side. Of course he will put his healing ranger in the next side and the dissipate will be good but not in the second round, I will put down the golden giant. So that the golden giant will provide some tank with some DPS as well. Now let's see what he will do and... <laughs> he missed his healing ranger placement, that's really bad. Now his healing ranger will not heal his shield maiden. And from now I will say it, this round will be for us. The shield maiden will be down soon and... The golden giant will be down after that. And the healing ranger lonely can't do anything, so this round will be for us. Now in this round, the key to victory against this match is the dissipate, especially the dissipate of the miner. But firstly, I will upgrade my mega knight to large radius and move him one tile to the right. So if he put his healing ranger on that lane, the healing ranger will be stunned by the mega knight. And I will upgrade my miner to the dissipate and move him to the other lane and put the mini P.E.K.K.A on top of the shield. Now everything is positioned perfectly and really well played by him with that bowler placement but it will not help him at all my miner is dissipating his healing ranger and big jump from the mega knight he's in trouble his healing ranger is down and this round as well will definitely be for us now in round number four the game is not fun without a fisherman right so let's bring him and i will put him in here and this time i will cover my mega knight i must put a mini behind him like this, I will put the royal champion behind the mega knight so that the bowler will not be able to push back my mega knight and everything looks perfect. Now let's see what he will do for us. Nice. We covered the bowler hit with the royal champion and the miner. Insane value from the miner. Big jump from the mega knight as well. And he's already dead. And after this match, will be time for us to be dead. <laughs> because we are gonna use this shield made in tech. He did not use one of these minis, but don't worry, I know the deck that he was using. Now I have one point and the challenge zero. Two more to go. We are going to play in top 250 with a level 5 shield made. Let us have some hope guys, let us have some hope. Nothing is impossible, we must just try. It is so impossible, how I must win when the enemy has this freaking 2 star mini P.E.K.K.A. That's so annoying. Well... Looks like we are gonna take our first lose in this challenge. Wait a minute. The mini P.E.K.K.A is down. And... Great value by the Musketeer. We still have a chance. We still have a chance. We must not lose our hope. Come on. Yes, we got our first win. There's a small chance. I will try to win. I will try my best. Now, in round number 4, I think the best thing to do is upgrading the Golden Giant with the first ability and... Reroll and I'm grading the healing ranger to the second ability so that she will heal more units and move my units like mm, like this. Hopefully, the mini P.E.K.K.A will not be able to dissipate my shield maiden. And nice, the shield maiden is far away from the mini P.E.K.K.A, that's really good. And that mega knight will not be able to stun my uh, healing ranger so that she will continue healing and. Finally, my first shield maiden ability in this match. At least we didn't lose without a shield maiden ability. And the healing ranger is doing her job really perfectly. The mega knight is down. Only the golden giant with a royal champion. Come on, healing ranger. One more heal and we will be okay to win. Come on, yes. 
let's go looks like we are coming back guys looks like we are coming back all we have to do is try our best now in the last round i will move the musky one tail to the back and upgrade my healing ranger to the three star now she will get serious and upgrading the musketeer to the double shot now our win conditions are perfectly upgraded and switch to the other side like this now let us see what will happen great bow bowler value and that shield maiden will never be able to charge her ability again the healing ranger is doing her job and musketeer op uh, shot come on take down that rc and we will be fine the rc is down the golden giant is stunning and ladies and gentlemen we are learning when listening in here and it is the impossible is not impossible we made the big comeback let's go that's win streak number four just one more win to finish this challenge okay let's go all right in this match we are facing a bk player in the mirror map in the first round i will put down the mega knight and the royal champion on top of the mirror and the spear goblin in in front of the mirror something tells me that i must put it in here i don't know i will do it just now let's see what will happen oh that was not the best spear position wait a minute actually it was now because of the mirrored archer we will get one reset from the royal champion and the bk is in trouble the bk is down and this will be an easy first round victory for us now in round number two i got the golden giant so i'll put him down and he got the mirror tile on the right hand side so i'll put my spear goblin to here and our seat with on the mirror and one mini pega please yes the mini pega in here so that the mirrored rc will be spawned on the other side and hopefully we will protect something with that now let's see nice we protected the bowler hit and his archer is not targeting my mirrored rc now it's time for the rc to pump up there's one reset and two reset the bk is in trouble and another reset from the real rc and another one finishes the round number two for us let's go this will be a uh, fast to it now in round number three i will of course put down the prince but firstly i will upgrade my spear goblin to more damage and put down the prince in i will put down the prince in the middle hopefully we will hit his uh, bk with the prince and like this we will be fine to go now let's see what will happen and the prince didn't go the bk that's really bad and huge bowler value from him that was really insane come on mega knight jump the bk was able to judge his ability that's really bad all of my units are dying in a second and we lost round number three looks like it will not be a fast win now in round number four i will maybe the mini pekka dissipate is the key i will upgrade the mini pekka and another mini pekka upgrade as well i will cycle those princes and put maybe the prince is better now i will cover my spear goblin as well because he's important now let's see what will happen nice we got a big spear goblin hit that's really good come on royal champion give us some resets that's one that's two don't let that bk to charge yes that's great a beautiful amount of the resets and the dart goblin oh no beautiful critical hit and the mini pekka finishes the game for us let's go op mini pekka and this will be win streak number five we completed this challenge with zero losses i was not expecting that but it happened this video will be fast because of that anyways i hope you enjoyed the video we have a long way till the next balance changes in mid season so maybe i will do more challenge videos and i will try to make some boom beat frontline contents as well until the next time and the next video peace out